So are you using Google Drive and do you know how to move multiple files and put them into one folder? Well, this video is going to show you exactly how to do that. Hi, my name's Anita Wong and on this channel you'll find videos about Facebook, Instagram and YouTube marketing and also what happens behind the scenes of a business. So the best way for me to show you how to do it is to just jump straight into the desktop. Okay, so here I am in Google Drive. If we go to the Drive icon, this is where everything is filed inside of Google Drive. If you go to your drive, which is this bit on the side, it says My Drive, you'll see that if you click just on the left here, a little drop down, and this will have all of the folders that you have in your drive. Now, I like to organize my drive in years. So 2023 is a year that I have my information in. If I click it, you can see that all of my files are very neatly organized. Now, if I go back, you can see that in this area of my drive, there is lots of stuff that is not in order and it's in the wrong place. So I'm gonna show you how you can select a certain amount of this and put it into a file ready for you to sort. So to create a new folder, you go plus new and then you do folder and I'm gonna put files to sort. Okay, and then you click create. Now that folder is going to be put in here in alphabetical order. So if I go down to where the F's are, it's here in blue. Most of you sometimes might come into your drive and all of your files are like that. And it's not very easy to see what's going on, is it? They're all in the wrong order. So I like to look at my files in a grid manner. So I click that little icon at the top. Okay, so now that you've made the files to sort folder, all you need to do in order to grab the files is to click the first file and then maybe scroll down four rows and with your shift key, so I'll just show you the shift key quickly. With the shift key on your keyboard, so here's the shift key on my Mac keyboard. If you're using a PC, it's the same shift key. So all you have to do is click the first file and then press the shift key down and hold the shift key and then go down maybe three rows at a time and click the end one. And as you can see, all three rows have been lit up with this blue outline. And then all I want you to do is grab any of the blue boxes, press the left hand button on your mouse and drag them until you get to the file to sort icon and just drop them in there. And then what will happen is that they will then show up inside the file to sort folder. So to check that, we can go into the file to sort folder. And as you can see, I've started moving all of the files that I don't want just sitting on my drive into that folder. So I'll just show you again, click the first row, press the shift key down on your keyboard, go down, choose an area to stop. So I've got four rows there. Scroll up so you can see the file with your left mouse button, press and hold and drop it in the file that you want it to go into. So I'll drop it in there. It takes a couple of seconds for it to go in and Google Drive will tell you, look, 24 files have been moved to my drive to files to sort. And you just keep repeating this process until all of the files that you want into that folder. So let's go up a little bit more. Let's go to here. Scroll back up to where you can see the folder. Press the left hand mouse button, keep it down and drag everything into the file you want it to go into. Drop it by letting go of the mouse button. Wait until Google Drive tells you that it's loaded it up and it will tell you by showing you the 30 files have moved. And you just keep repeating this process over and over again until you've moved all of those files that you want into that drive area. Because then eventually your drive will look very tidy and it will look like mine does here where everything is in my client folders and there's no files elsewhere. So that's a really good practice to get into is to create folders inside your Google Drive and name them so that you can upload assets such as videos, files, documents into that folder. 
and keep everything organized so that when somebody asks you for something, maybe a picture or a document or a video that you need to give, you can go straight into your Google Drive, go straight to the folder that's associated with that person or that company and access the assets that they want. Don't forget that if you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Please follow along my channel by subscribing and clicking the bell. My name's Anita Wong. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below this video and I will see you in the next video.